So today I saw a frog in a pot for the first time. Now that is a very weird thing to say, but it is kind of true in a way. Today I played a game called Froggy Pot by Cantus Mori on itch.io. It's a visual novel and the description of the game says a short cozy game with a small side of ex existential crisis. Now as a quick like trigger warning type of deal, there is a brief mention of the loss of a loved one in this story. So be aware of that. Please do not watch if that's going to have some sort of emotional effect on you. I do not want that happening. Now, before we begin, I wanted to tell you that this is the seventh video out of an eight-part series on my channel called Summertime Swing. The link to the playlist with all the other videos in the series will be somewhere up here, I believe it on that side, if you wanted to go check those out. Now, before we fully begin, make sure you go ahead and like and subscribe so that I know you enjoy my content, as well as the past videos in this series, and I continue making more content similar to this video. Now, without further ado, let's go ahead and get this frog out of this almost boiling water pot. Okay, so today we're playing a game called Froggy Pot by, I don't know if I'm going to be able to pronounce this, Cantusmori? Cantusmori? So, I guess we just click start. It's a frog! Oh, that's cute. Wait. Oh, that's adorable, actually. Froggy is sleeping soundly in the water. The pot, it's warm and cozy now but it will come to a boil eventually. What? Why are you, wait, why are you sleeping in a pot? Wait, I didn't even think about that. It will be dangerous, so please help convince Froggy to get out of the pot soon. I'm counting on you. Who are you? Wait, oh my God, no. Yes. Bam, bam, okay. Anyway, uh, uh, hello, wakey wakey, or dot dot dot. Um, wakey wakey! Whoa! You are awake. <coughs> Jeez, you scared me. Why are you in a pot? Why am I in a pot? Why are you here? I don't. I was having such a nice nap and you woke me up. Sorry for disturbing you. Apology accepted. Aw, that was fast. Hey, <laughs> relax, it's all good. Anyway, I'm just waiting for the water to heat up. It's nice and warm. Well, don't wait for it to heat up. You tired? Why don't you join me? The pot will come to a boil soon. Will you come out? Ah, uh, don't worry. I'll get out eventually. No, you won't. I just want to relax for a bit. Go in like a hot tub, not a pot. Once it gets too hot, I'll get out for sure. Yeah. Uh. No, you won't. Wait, but this is adorable. Uh, how long have you been in here? I don't know. But it must have been quite a while now. But, oh man, I'm so tired. Some days are just like that. I don't want to do anything, you know? Oh. I'm sure you understand, right? Sure. Anyway, what about you? So, uh, how's your day been? Uh, <laughs> I'm feeling really happy. It's alright, same as usual. I'm having a rough day. What is this, a mood survey? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Oi, I'm the one asking the questions here. You barge into my pot, disturb my alone time, and refuse to take my mood survey? Hmm. Or no, that said estimate. I thought it said sm. I was like, what? Well, if you have the energy to joke, I guess you're alright. Okay. Hmm, the pot is getting pretty cozy. I feel like getting a little warmer. Wanna join? No. No, thanks. You should really get out. No, but why? Why on earth? Why? Whoa. No, but why on earth are you wearing a jacket in the water? That's blasphemy. Um. I think I'm gonna do this one. Hey, I can do what I want. Doesn't matter if it gets wet. I ain't getting out anyways. Nice try, huh? Froggy can do what Froggy wants. If I get out, I'll have to return to being a responsible adult. You look like you're four. <sighs> Sigh. Uh, you can't run away forever. It's not going to be that bad. What kind of responsibilities? You're an adult. Exactly. You're an adult? What? I'm in my 20s. Are you sure? Do I really look that small? Yes. Jeez, who are you anyway? I'm gonna be staying cozied up in here, so look, just leave me alone in peace, will you? No. Guess you aren't leaving. 
why don't we talk about something else? So, anything you like to do? Uh, I'll do this one because then maybe, well, one, I do actually like playing games. Two, maybe I'll be like, let's go play a game or something. I don't know. Oh, me too. Maybe one day we can play a game together. You know, sometimes I get told that playing games is super unproductive. Oh. That I should be working on improving myself, my goals. But sometimes I want to grind in game and not real life, you know. What about you? Any hobbies? Hmm, I like guitar. <gasps> I have guitars. I'm bad at playing them. I don't remember how to play them at all. I used to be able to play them on stream. Uh, in fact, I was just playing a song this morning. I wrote it myself. I'm very proud of it. Can I hear it? No. It's not good enough yet. Oh. It has breaks all over and it doesn't really follow any beats. Well, at least it has a good beginning, I think. And not that you'd be able to hear it anyway. Huh? Alright, another thing I love doing is origami. Wow. Wow. They say if you fold a thousand cranes, your wish will come true. Hmm? Oh, I don't have a wish if that's what you're asking. Do I need to have a wish? Um, most people would, or no, not really. Well, I feel like if I say this, their wish is going to be to stay in the pot. Uh, no, not really? Hmm, though I've never thought about what I'd wish for if I, if given the chance. I can make a wish now. Okay, you're going to wish to stay in the pot. That's a neat idea. Hmm. I guess my wish would be to always be with the one I love, I suppose? That's cute. <laughs> But I don't know if that's possible right now. Why not? Maybe when my time is up too, we'll reunite in the sky. What the heck? Or wherever do- Oh my goodness. Sorry. Didn't mean to bring the mood down. Um. Oh, I still have so much to do, and yet I'm just lying here floating away. <laughs> I'm sure they'd want you to live well. Yes. I'm sure she would- Who? person most important to me goes by the name Sap. I'm that I thought it's so rude, I'm sorry. Miss Sap, please get out of the pot. I'm sorry, I can't I'm gonna drag you out of the pot. I don't know why. When I'm in here my knees feel weak and my arms spaghetti. No I just can't move. Oh. I just can't Oh no Oh, I forgot I had to click again. I was like, did I fail? I haven't seen the sky in a while. Where the heck are we? We're just in a white void. Wait, what? Speaking of the sky, I've always wanted to go to space. I wanted to be an astronaut. Ooh. But that seems too hard. Fair enough. So instead, I fold paper planes and dream of the skies. That's the only way to do it. Oh, you're still here. This must be incredibly boring for you. No? I'm sorry. No! I didn't think you'd stay this long. Maybe it's time for you to leave. Nope. Man, it's getting hot in here. Oh, it's steaming now. No. Oh my god, it's literally smoking. No. Come on. Froggy, why won't you leave the spot? I... I know I've got to get out soon. But even if I go back, what will I do? Back to work, the hustle, the grind, all that. And to what end? At the end of the day, no one is there to share my days with. What? No one anymore. That's so sad. If passion is a candle, mine burned out a long time ago. Uh, okay, do I just let her, let her go on, or do I say still no good will come of staying here? I think I'm gonna say that. The world that awaits me outside is this, outside this pot. Do I really belong? Yes. You don't belong in a pot. You're a not a child apparently you're a 20 year old everyone is so different from me they have their passions and dreams but i don't really have any you love origami you want to go to space what else did you say what else did you say crap what did she say oh my god i can't remember oh my gosh that's annoying yeah being with sap made me happy sap made me a better person this is so sad i know it shouldn't be this way but Sap was my pa- Okay, now that's weird. In a sense. Sap saw value in the things I did and encouraged me. And then there was one more person in this world with me. Who? But now that Sap's gone, I don't know what to do anymore. Where is that other person? No! 
This is so sad. So I passed away from illness about a year ago. Since then I've been in stagnation. What does that mean? I don't remember. These days I just wade through life without much meaning. GET OUT OF THE PUT! Gives you some comfort. Go into bed. Tell me, is that wrong? Yes. No, get out of the stupid pot. It's boiling almost. Um, do you think I'm letting my family down? It's something that's been on my mind lately. Even though Sap's gone, my family are still relying on me back at home. But here I am, just staying here, not doing anything. Yeah, get out of the pot. It's as if time stops when I'm in the spot. No more worries, no more troubles. They're expecting great things of me. If they found out about my situation right now, they'd surely be disappointed in me. Well, then get out the pot. Uh, you think you're, uh, ooh. You're a disappointment to anyone. Okay, if I'm thinking of her own happiness, I do want to do that, but I guess she's happy in the pot. So maybe I won't say you weren't disappointing to anyone. Thanks. Of course, my parents would never tell me they are disappointed in me. But I can see it in their eyes and sad smiles. Do you think if I continue working hard that will ever change someday? Yes. Uh, I don't know what makes me happy. Yeah, pot. Get out the pot. True. Yes, but if I get out of the pot, will there be anything worth going back to? When I meet my friends, they'll ask how my job is going, if I'm doing something exciting. But I don't have anything to talk about other than my ham- Hamster? <gasps> I love hamsters. It's kind of old, but he's still killing it at the wheel. When I meet my family, they'll ask about the things I've achieved over the year. How am I supposed to tell them I've done nothing? My life has remained the same. Time is slipping away. Well, get out the pot. Is it still steaming? Wait. Yeah, it is still steaming. Okay. At my age, everyone else has already moved on. But I'm stuck here. I'll still be here for you. That's adorable. Sorry. I shouldn't be, like, smiling that hard at that. Please don't say that. We met a few minutes ago. How much could you possibly know about me? Ultimately, what happens to Froggy is inconsensual to you. Did my phone just go off? Nope. Because you'll continue to live and exist and life will go on for you regardless. You'll eventually forget about Froggy in due time. No. I'm just a passing Froggy in a pot. You just want to be happy you say Froggy. I really want you to be happy. Please just get about that. Can I say all? Yes. Yes. Like, this is my choice. Yes is my choice. Uh. I really want you to be happy. If you really wanted to save me, you would have pulled me out of the pot. Exactly! Why don't I pull me out of the pot? Uh, you would have tried to turn the heat off. If you really didn't want to, you would come here right now. Stupid. But you just sit there talking to me, asking me to get out. Wait, I haven't, like, saved anything. Quick save. What is a quick save? But you don't do anything. You're not my friend. You're just a stranger. You're not Sap. No, get out of the pot. Froggy has something to go back to. Passion, love, happiness, witches. No! Such things are fleeting for Froggy, yet despite my flawed self... I found someone who accepted me and, I, and loved me, but even they are not here anymore. No! So tell me, how should I... How should I continue to exist? Oh, middle. Of course you don't. Because... You are me. Huh? The person I've been talking to is myself, isn't it? Convincing myself to get out of the pot with words Sap used to tell me. Holding on to tiny pieces of heart she gave me. What? Hold on, wait, whoa, hold on. I need a second. Coming up with to continue trying. I was over here, though. Every day I tell myself to get out of this pot. It should be so easy. So why is it so hard? I'm truly really hopeless. I know! It's not like I don't try. I don't want to stay like this. Oh, wait, this is where the mirror is. Oh, wait. But every time I, I think, what if I get out of the pot and I do my best and things don't change? What if it doesn't get better after all? I would end up feeling worse than if I never got out. Is that 
it's that it is that kind of world worth going back to? Yes. So I end up talking to myself, consoling myself like this to get out of the pot. No. Froggy seems to think you aren't real. <laughs> that you're just imaginary. Um, that's kind of rude. Uh. Wait, is Sap the one talking to me? Hello, Earth to Froggy. Hey, I'm not you. Excuse you. I'm a separate person, you know. Well, that one's kind of funny. That one's kind of funny. Uh, that one seems almost passive aggressive, but like in a nice way. So I'm gonna do this one. Huh? Uh, I'm a separate person. Uh, I mean, you are you. You aren't talking to yourself. You have a hamster, but I sure don't. SMH, I would never wear a hoodie in a pot filled with water like you would. I'm gonna do that one. You. Hey! But I don't understand. You're not alone here, I'm with you. Wait, why is her nose so big? That was rude, sorry. You you said you're real? I'm not just talking to myself the whole time? But if so, how come I can't see you? You're just a voice, so I must be imagining things. I must be so far gone I've started hallucinating or something. If you really are real, come here right now. I wish I can, but I physically cannot enter your world. You're saying you're not from this world? <laughs> Wait, what am I right now? I'm so confused. I don't understand. Neither do I. Um. Uh, I want to help you, but I cannot come to your world. What does that even mean? I So talking is the only thing I can do. I see. But you're just someone I met a few minutes ago. Why do you care what happens to Froggy? Do I need a reason to care about somebody else? Mm, yeah. Mm. You know, that's what Sap told me when we first met. I had nothing to offer her, but she cared. This is so sad. Maybe I had it wrong the whole time. If you say you are real, prove it. Prove to me that you're here. How? Yeah, what? I don't know. If you were me, you wouldn't know how either. Wait, crap. Please tell me. Tell me I'm not alone. Hmm. Seems like Froggy isn't fully convinced. I'm not fully convinced that I'm here. not her either. Froggy can't see me, but there is one thing I can do. I can tell Froggy my name. My name is... Okay, wait, do I want to put Sap or do I want to put my name? Do I want to put... Oh, I just spelled it wrong. There we go. Huh? Aceox. <laughs> so you really are from another world, Aceox. Oh, please stop saying my name. You're real. Sniffle. Uh, right in the flesh I am. I just told you my name, how can you be so sure? Absolutely not, I'm not saying that. I'm just in your head. Actually, Aceox isn't my real name. Okay, now is my computer stalking me now? Because that's true. Uh, I'm gonna do that because it's kind of funny. Hee hee hee. Yay. Wait, is the heat gone? Wait, where'd my music go? Man, geez, this sure is a long day. Okay, where is the steam going? Gone. And where'd my music go? I don't know if I have- Okay, there's my- Oh, wait! Okay, we got good music now. I don't know if I have the strength to face the outside world right now. I'm still afraid of messing up. Uh, it's okay to mess up, but despite everything, you're still here, aren't you? Uh, I'm gonna say that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yay! She's smiling. Yeah, I'm still here. Um, do you think it will get better after I go back? Yeah- Oh. Uh, of course. You aren't. Co Sorry? Clairvoyant? Stop using big words against me. Why is that in Danish? What? I want English! Penetrating or far seeing? Oh, yeah, far seeing makes sense. Okay. Haha, uh -huh, I suppose there really is no way of knowing. That that be life. What? Okay, get out of the stupid pot. Oh, can Froggy ask you something? Yes. What is it? Are we friends now? Absolutely. You mean we weren't friends till now? Ha. Huh. I just wanted to confirm. Yay! Oh, that's adorable. And sorry for calling you a stranger just now. Yeah. Mm. I've been here long enough. Well, it's about time I get out of the pot. 
though it's cheesy having someone to talk to that isn't myself. I feel a little bit yay! Back into a world of uncertainty I go. Yay. I almost definitely feel helpless again once I leave this pot. No. But life has to go on even if there isn't meeting, I suppose. At the very least, I still have to take care of Ham Ham. The hamster! Oh my gosh, yes. Thank you for talking to me. It's been a while since I talked to someone other than myself. Did she just refer to herself in third person? Froggy's been living alone for so long now, away from my family. And Sap. That's so sad. I don't know if life will get any easier and less confusing. Oh, absolutely not. It won't get any more. Any less confusing. But I suppose I can't stay here forever. Yes. You know, Sap once told me, a pebble that lies on the shore of a beach doesn't need a reason to be there. What? It just is. It just exists. Huh? But it doesn't make it any less of a pebble. So I guess for now it's okay for me to simply exist too. Yes! Until the day I can be happy again. Until then, I'll get out of the pot for now. Yay! I did it! Though you are so far away, Froggy will always be cheering you on. Oh, that's adorable. Finn. Hello. This is- Oh, it's the creator! Hi! Farewell. Bye! That was so cute. Oh my gosh. That was adorable. Is there a way I could have failed? I don't think so, but I'm glad I didn't. I'm gonna look up if there's a way to fail. I don't think there's a way to fail, and I'm very glad that there is not a thing to fail. Okay, well, I'm gonna cut to the outro. That was so cute. Um, Here's outro, Kaylin, Aceox thing. Wee! Okay, that game was too adorable, but also very sad at the same time. If you do want to download this game and play it for yourself, there is a link in the description. It's called Froggy Pot by Kansas Mori on itch.io. As a reminder, this is the seventh video out of an eight part series on my channel called Summertime Swing. This is only the second to last video and I'm very excited to finish. If you've missed the other videos in the series, there is a link somewhere in up here and in the beginning of the video there was as well, or it is on the main page of my channel. Now, if you did enjoy this video, please make sure to like and subscribe so I know you enjoyed it and I'll continue making content similar to this. Now, other than that, I hope you have a great day, night, or whatever time of day it is where you are. And I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys.